Hi, it's Michael, and we are here in the Young Voices Suite. We saw this show at the Dadun Cultural Center, and this is our friend Murphy. We met him at the Spring Art Show at Fun Year Art Gallery just about a month ago. We saw your painting with the tent, yes. and we were talking about that. You have these new pieces, and Murphy is posting a lot on Instagram. I'm always seeing you posting things. So these are some new pieces that you have here. This one's quite interesting. What is this one about? Um, I was thinking about how big the wind blow, the coconut will drop down from, the, drop from the tree. tree yes. Oh, wow. And we were seeing, you'll have to check our other episode from the spring show. You were talking about a figure, is it male, is it female? But there was a cramp in the leg. And it was a lot of this color, so it's interesting to see you going brighter. Mm, yes. You're using bright colors now. And are you painting very quickly? It seems you're always showing new painting you're working on. Mm, not that quickly. Not but that I, quick. I paint <clears throat> a lot in one time. Okay, so he's working on more than one piece. Now, uh, behind us here is another artist. This is who? Do you know the name of this artist? Ro Jaewon. Yeah, so, so this was also at the spring, yeah, fun year art gallery. And here we have this artist that we saw at the Sung Fung gallery. And I don't think we saw this piece, but we're hoping to meet her tomorrow here at Art Taijong. So this is the Young Voices Suite. So it's all uh, young, just graduated artists. You can see there's a logo here. How many artists are in this suite here, this room? Um, 13. 13. So it's all different. Um, and we know some of them and some of them we're not sure. What about Arthur? Is Arthur here? Mr. Arthur, does he have any work here? I don't see anything. But I do like these ones with the gumdrop. We saw this. So, Murphy, great to see you again. We're hopefully going to go to Murphy's uh, studio, but he was busy getting ready for our Taijong. So he's done now. So we want to see where you're making all of this stuff. Great to see you again. Let's go see some more artists. Hi, it's Michael and I'm back in the Youth Voices suite here. Yesterday we talked to Murphy and today we're lucky to meet Yu Ting. Yu Ting, you might remember, we covered her show at the Songfeng Gallery in Beitun District with the butterflies. You think so nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I was going to send out a picture on Instagram. I'm waiting oh. to meet you. Sung Fong Joy from Sung Fong Gallery sent yes. me a message that you would be here today. Oh, yeah. But you have some work in their gallery upstairs yes. and then also here. Yes. This is a new piece. Um, we haven't seen this one before. 2000? Yeah. Yes. And yeah. um, it, it was the Sung Fong Gallery the, oh, the this was artwork. here? This artwork is the... From Song Fung Gallery? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And we learned that you're very inspired by butterflies. Yeah, and my butterfly is uh, focused on the butterfly of specimen. Okay. Not the creature butterfly. Okay. Because I am enjoying collect collection of butterflies, oh, okay. specimen. And so... I, I, uh, I think that butterfly is more than just flying the sky. And when I buy butterfly on the internet, I think they have more imagination from the market. Yes. Uh, especially the internet market. Okay. It can that the things. Uh, it, the market can give things more uh, imagination, like uh, butterflies, like uh, uh, how to say. It? <laughs> mm. So you're buying specimen butterfly specimen. You're buying yeah. butterfly on, on the internet. internet. So you collect yeah. butterflies, yes. and do you use those for your painting? Yeah, and you're studying them, and then you paint them. 
Yeah. Yes. I, I make specimen also. Oh. Yeah. I have some collection. Yes. Like uh, glass. Yes, I saw you had a sculpture. Yeah. yeah kind yeah. of a cubist sculpture. Yes, yeah, yeah. Those are real butterflies. Yes. And some are painted. And all the specimen I made are all real. Oh. Yeah. Oh wow. So it's quite interesting. So this this butterfly in my artwork is all my collection. From your collection, yeah. okay. And one of the paintings we saw at Songfeng, there was a dinosaur at the top. Is oh, that? Oh, that, that was from the the house and movie. The, the Jurassic yeah, Park. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so you're interested in that, and you put it together. Yeah, I, I think the life is very complicated in this world yes. because we can buy it in on the internet or an, anywhere right so it is more than more than cure or something right and we can uh, put it in anywhere right. like my painting painting or a yeah. museum so you're putting a lot of things that you're interested in your paintings yeah. you had this one has baby bird. You had the big one with the sheep. Yeah. That big sheep in it. I think that the sheep is looking at me. Like I, I can feel a little bit creepy. Right. Uh, because in this year, I have a, I have a cat. Uh. He died by cancer. Oh. So I think I have another feeling about life. Okay. And before this time, I think. Uh, I was playing with the spaceman, the life and death. But right. Uh, after this thing, I feel I have to be more uh, careful. Careful to yeah. to think about this thing, so right. that piece can become part of that. So a lot of your work is the life cycle. Yeah. And the butterfly has a very fast life cycle. But hopefully humans, we have a longer life cycle. Yeah. Well, we're so happy to meet you because we, we quite enjoy your work. I love the color. Oh, thank you. I love the bright color. And uh, I think it's so great that you had that show at Songfeng Gallery. Yeah. So you are a young artist, so you're here in the Young Voices Suite. Yes. And then she also has some pieces upstairs at Songfeng Gallery. Yeah. Yuting, thank you so much for your time. Lovely to meet you. And if you would like to see her show, it's at Song Fun Gallery. And we're going to follow her because she's got great work. We'd like to see more of it. Let's go meet some more artists. Hi, it's Michael, and I'm back with another artist here in the Young Voices Suite. This is Angus. Angus, we talked to Murphy yesterday. We just talked to Yuting here. And I saw you've got these pieces here. Angus, thanks for taking the time to talk with us. Where are you from in Taiwan? I'm from Taipei. Taipei. Taipei, right. And then these pieces here, what are they made out of? Yeah, I'm for this series, I'm focused on the burst of like the flame or even a tragedy. Okay. And so, f first of all, I draw some these kind of scenes, like called accidents, okay. or like a plane crash, okay. or even a forest plane. Okay. Then I think this kind of issue is because the environment of the speed. Right. Because we are going so fast. Right. Even our spires is on I wanna be speed us, speed us, speed us. Right, everything so, faster. Yeah. So this kind of like hurry up and concept right. I think most of us are really rooting in. So But it almost looks like a Chinese character outline. Really? What kind of yeah. Chinese character? I don't character? know, I just see a character like a <laughs> like this shape kind of looks like it could be like the frame. So it's quite thick here and this is with plaster? Uh, what's the material? Yeah, yeah plaster, plaster and paper. Plaster and yeah, paper. Like mix out together. Okay. So you've got uh, almost it's a sculpture yeah kind and, of sculpture and then after your painting no I first of all I paint I, I paint okay and later I just got the sculpture okay 
and so because and so first of all I do the painting it means an uh, issue and I draw the issue the event right and later I do the sculpture so actually it like destroy the event okay from the objective things into a into a abstract thing okay so I and I, and I think abstract things is kind of can represent a slowly tempo. Okay. So. And then the colors here, this is also, you're using this to kind of show that it is yeah, kind of a like tragedy. A, yeah, it's like an intention energy. Yes, so it could be like a hot fire. Exactly. Yeah. And then this, is this like a mold of a leaf or crumpled? Paper or something. Yeah. 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 After I just draw it, after I draw it, and I washed, I squid it, and even destroyed it into a the, another another kind of painting. Wow. I reduce it. And are these heavy? They seem to be. The, can you hang them on the wall? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Yes, it, it's like better to hang on the wall. Okay. And are you only working in plaster, or do you paint as well? And I usually paint into like. Uh, yeah, show us your. You've got your catalog. So I always do like the paper. Okay. Thing, and I just wash it or even destroy it. Oh, okay. Like tear it. So more like an installation. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. yeah. Okay. Were you at the Dadong? Culture Center. Yeah, sure. Yes, and you had the bees going up yeah, the wall yeah, in exactly. the ceiling. Oh yes. wow! <laughs> so we're meeting you. So we did go to the. Really. Yeah, we went to the. So you have seen my work. Yeah, so youth vo Thank voices you. show. So we did show that. Maybe we'll show a picture of that because I was saying, and it was a lot of cardboard. Yeah. yeah. And you had the bees going all the way up the ceiling. Well, that's interesting. We're getting to meet everyone. So we met. Or we've seen this artist at uh, Fun Year Art Gallery. They had a show, the spring show with Murphy. And uh, our friend Cynthia is working at a gallery on the eighth floor. So we're just seeing the same familiar faces all over. So Angus, it's so great to meet you. you. And we hope to see you at another show sure, soon. Sure. Okay? Sure. Good luck. Let's go see some more artists.